every day is trap day. Oh. A way to approximate definite integrals or area under a curve is by using the trapezoidal rule. This means you are using different sizes of trapezoids to represent the area under the curve. So what you're trying to do on this one is you're trying to solve this definite integral down here on the interval from A to B. And so this is A, this is B. So you're trying to find the area under the curve from here to here. And how we're going to do that is using the trapezoidal rule. But since the intervals are uneven, that means the changes in base are different. Like that's smaller than that. You have to use a little bit different formula than just the normal trap rule. So what you have to do, you're going to use these right here. So you do x naught plus x1 times delta x over 2. And I'm going to write that out. So it would be f of x naught plus f of x1 times by delta x over 2 plus f of x1 plus f of x2 times by delta x over 2. And then you add that to the next one. And then you finish with f of x3 plus f of x4 times by delta x over 2 and that gives you your answer. So on this one it's an example of a table. Um, so you're trying to find, again you just definitely the area of this and using the trapezoidal rule since change in x, they're different, they're all different sizes. You can't use the normal trapezoidal rule, so you have to use the other one. And how we're gonna do this, so we're gonna that's gonna be our change in x, and this is gonna be our x1, x2, x3, and x4. So what that comes out to be is 10 plus 12, that's x1 plus x2 times by 2 over 2 plus 12 plus 15 times by 1 over 2. And then you add that to 15 plus 20 times by 3, which is the delta x for that, equals 2. And that equals 22 plus 27 plus 52.5, which equals 101.5. So all that is is the x1 plus x2 times the delta x over 2, and then you do x2 plus x3, delta x over 2, x3 plus x4, delta x over 2, and then this is your answer right here. So it's pretty easy. And this, the table is a more common one you're probably going to see on any tests or things than the graph, and it's really simple. So yeah. Trap rule, okay?